Another year has ended, so this time around, we will take a look at what happened in 2021, particularly the bloopers that I've had throughout the year. Let's do this. Hello guys, I'm Reagan and welcome back to my channel. As you're all well aware, most of us car reviewers go through our fair share of challenges whenever we create these car review videos for you guys. Uh, 2021 has been a particularly challenging year for me uh, since I contracted severe COVID last March to uh, even losing one of my GoPros on one of my shoots and even to breaking my three-month-old camera lens on one of our location filmings. Still guys, uh, despite all of these challenges, well, 2021 ended up being a banner year for me since I created 128 videos for you guys, which is, which is a new record considering that I even lost almost two months to COVID. Now, I'm pretty sure most of you guys are already waiting for what sort of bloopers I can show you on this video, so I will just head right into it. Now, as you all know, I film in public places and normally the number one, uh, well, disruptor in some of my, uh, my clips is the noise. Now, check out some of these video clips where I have to deal with these noisy environments. Leather covering here, which automatically opens. If you're my subscriber already, thank you so much for your support. The middle spec Okavango Urban is still waving its hand and saying, Present! Ang ingay mo! <laughs> Which has been renamed to the Land Cruiser by 1954. Oh. Which was renamed to the Land Cruiser in 1954. Oh, God. When I got in touch with Honda Cars Philippines to do a car review, Ang ingay talaga dito, lintik. If you're new to my channel, I hope you hit that subscribe button and become part of the Reagan's Rides family. If you're my subscriber already, ah. <laughs> The Suzuki Swift has always been a favorite city car of mine. <laughs> okay, alam mo, chichempo lang ako pagka ano. Yep, my usual opponents are the loud motorcycle exhaust and the occasional ringing telephone in a dealership showroom. Still guys, despite these noisy challenges that I've had throughout the year, I was still able to get over 5 million new views for the year 2021. And of course, I am super grateful to all of you watching this video for supporting my channel and of course supporting my car reviews. In particular, I am grateful to those who frequently comment and leave a like to my videos like Brother Louis, Mark Javier, Michael Bridzel and Sheila Chua. Now, if you're one of my avid supporters in the channel and I didn't mention your name, still, my thanks goes out to you guys. Thank you so much for supporting Reagan's Rides. Another challenge whenever I film a car review is an interruption of, let's say, a well-delivered clip, uh, whether it's a passing car on the street to the occasional fly. <laughs> now, check out some of these funny interruption blooper videos that happened throughout the year. Now, what's even more stunning is the asking price of this beauty. You see... Saba. Right, and action. It's a 2016 Porsche 911 G... Ah, may langaw. Saba. At the end of the day, Gili managed to give this family hauler the complete package with the addition of the panoramic sunroof and fancier Matrix LED headlights. Whether it's worth the added 150 grand is completely up to you. There is nothing sleeper about this bright red color. Ah, and daming langaw. The mere fact that the wait lines for this Jimny can reach up to a year long means that it's pretty much still on the affordable side <laughs> okay so if you're somebody who needs to find the perfect driving position well you'll have to make the adjustments on the shoppy side and by then crystals inside the headlight housing now that guys <laughs> naman, pa ako. 
Now, speaking of cool air, we also get a functional air inlet here in the center of the front bumper to serve cool air to the radiator and a couple of air vents on the sides to serve cool air to your front brakes. Now, it is... Oh, sorry. Now, Ford knows that um, F-150s would be... Oh, sorry. Hello, boss? Yes, boss. The Cherry Tigo 7 Pro's cabin is nearly identical to that of the larger Cherry Tigo 8 Lux EX, which... <laughs> I... uh, maybe when the, hopefully, when the Trailblazer RS comes here to the country, maybe it will have... Ah, langaw! Ay, nako, buisit! Now, I don't know why these flies always wants to get into the scene whenever I'm doing my car reviews. I mean, guys, in Tagalog, naligo naman ako eh! <laughs> anyway, as the year went by, I proceeded to upgrade my equipment around August 2021 so that I can put out full 4K car review videos. Now, this resulted to over 25,500 new subscribers joining Reagan's Rides. Now, that took me to almost 50,000 subscribers by year end. However, guys, well, sometimes th these equipment just won't cooperate or sometimes the cars themselves uh, won't cooperate as well. So check out some of these equipment fail bloopers that happened throughout the year. Also special thanks to Honda Cars Manila and to Kia Philippines for lending out both of these vehicles to do this awesome compar. Whoa! <laughs> Ah. Oop! Patay, sabi ni. Bayan. This base model Yaris E. Patay. <laughs> so. The Subaru XV gets the same engine. Ayan na naman. <laughs> okay, okay, okay lang. Now, this backseat isn't just great because of how luxurious it is or because of these suicide doors that close with a push of a button and it doesn't want to push ah oh, come on man where's ah because i don't have the key fudge now throughout the year 2021 i've also made a lot of new friends amongst the local youtube car reviewers like of course jew of soju cars there's west of bearing ph motoring alex of jay walker iverson and julian of auto ph and Doc RM and Ma'am Elaine of Riding in Tandem. Now, all of us knows how hard it is to remember all of the specifications and the details of these vehicles uh, that, we, that we review, and I'm pretty sure most, or if not all of them, have also forgotten a line or two whenever they're doing their, their shoots. Now, just like them, I also forgot a lot of lines throughout the year, so here are some outtakes about me forgetting some of the lines that I'm supposed to deliver to you guys. And it's meant for wide open highways, mountain twisties, and even your favorite racetrack. Now, I forgot my script. Ko. <laughs> cut, cut. Now, those uh, power figures may not be the most um, powerful. <laughs> However, this is mostly just black and gray, and uh, yeah, uh, fudge, sapa. The wheels and tires of the EcoSport are large for such a tiny crossover. These are 17-inch wheels, and they're wrapped in 21550, 215 or 205. Well, it looks like the Fortuner LTD is still the better deal. Uh, I didn't really get it. Uh, ano ba yung next one? The cockpit of the Stinger Stinger. <laughs> now, since all of the sporty bits of the V trim, eh, my RS trim, pala. <laughs> which when you pop open the lift gate, you'll see that with the third row in use, you get 200. Uh, ilan? Sorry. Ah. <laughs> Napatay, na wala yung aking ano. Ilan yun? We get leather seats here, but these are premium Napa leather seats and both the driver and the passenger gets power adjustment. Of course, your leather seats, leather seats, fudge. <laughs> the Super Shogun would appeal to those who want a truck that is dressed out straight from their dealership. Now, oh God, I forgot. Cut, cut. Uh. 
Now power is sent to the front wheels via CVT transmission in this variant, but you can always opt for the sportier 5-speed manual. Tama ba 5-speed manual ba siya? Tama 5-speed? Nakalagay? Oh shit. Hindi, hindi yun intro ko eh. Ay wait kasi, nandi dito sila! Hi guys, it's me, RM! And me, Elaine! At ni... Sa pa. Sige, okay lang. Sa pa, sa pa, sorry. Cut, cut. Finally, I'd like to thank all of the car dealers and distributors who trusted me and Reagan's rides with lendouts throughout the entire year. These uh, lendouts enabled me to give you honest and in-depth car review videos, which I'm pretty sure has entertained most of you guys. Now, speaking of uh, entertainment, how about some blooper clips of uh, me getting tongue-tied on some of my shoots? <laughs> well, check this out. If you have a need for any Suzuki and you're within the area, well, head on down here to Suzuki Chu... Uh, Chu... Chu... Chukat. <laughs> for the price, the Expander GLS presents a really strong case. It also has seven seats and it... it uh, they, they, eh, 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 eh. <laughs> <sighs> now, the only thing that differentiates the 4x2 LSE from the 4x4 is this four-wheel uh, drive badge that we have here. Ah, fudge. Because, well, this is a subcompact SUV that's compet competing. Bah. Now, the amenities are also the same. We get ceiling mounted AC vents. Uh, ah! You'll see that it has cross drilled disc brakes that are over 15 inch in diameter. Diameter. Now, Toyota will not take this development standing down. So, uh, sitting down. Mali. We also have a nicely integrated rear spoiler that goes well with the rear bumper that's been given the same aero treatment treatment. Now this tells me that these are real uh, ref, 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 ref. <laughs> But the sheer number of omitted goodies would make you think twice about getting those savings. It made but made <laughs> Now, the closest small diesel crossovers out in the market are either the Honda CRV, the Mazda CX-5, and the Kia Sportage, all of which would cost you an arm and a leg in order to access. Now, enter the Sangyong Disoli. Disoli. Put Sangyong Disoli. <laughs> For your wheels, you get 14-inch steelies, which are pretty much expected from these workhorses. These uh, wheelie, wheelies. <laughs> so, so, what else can you expect from Reagan Strides in 2022? Well, definitely more bloopers would come. <laughs> That's for sure. Anyway, guys, 2022 is going to be an exciting year for the local automotive Philippine landscape because we are expecting a ton of new cars to enter the country well, as the economy recovers. Now, do you want to see another video of what cars, what upcoming new cars I am most excited about for 2022? Well then, subscribe to my channel right now because that video is coming up next. Now of course, I am going to deliver the freshest car reviews of these newest cars to you guys right here in the channel. Plus, I'm going to create some more pit stop videos like these and maybe I'll come up with another, like, another set of videos on car topics and tips from driving to maintenance and everything in between. But uh, for the meantime guys, enjoy this final set of outtakes well, I'll take bloopers that happened in 2021. Ingay, ingay. <laughs> All right. Now, the side profile of the Kia Soul Tuloy. <laughs> hey, bro. Ah. Nya wala. Kapun na punyet. Relax lang. Chill. Chill. <laughs> and action. Hello guys, I'm Reagan and welcome back to another Epic Comparo. I'm here once again with my good buddy and friend, Wes Kabungkal of Bearing PH Motoring. Hello everyone. <laughs> so there you have it guys. That was the year 2021 in review. Uh, I hope you enjoyed watching all of those outtakes and bloopers. Plus that a behind the scenes sneak peek of what happens during a car review shoot. I mean, it's, it's challenging. Uh, it may be tough. But if it's your passion, well then guys, it's well worth it. <laughs> anyway, oh, by the way, 
I don't know if you've noticed, but yeah, let me know if you like the shirt that I'm wearing right now. Uh, I'm still thinking about whether I should come up with a merch line of these uh, shirts, these really cool and fancy designs. Let me know in the comments below what you think. Uh, anyway, guys, and also subscribe to my channel yeah, for your regular dose of Philippine automotive content. See ya.